Hey, you guys, we are live. I'm Jordan Sparks. Ooh, and I'm Mike Epps. We're here to talk about our movie Sparkle that comes out in theaters August 17th. I saw the trailer for the first time today. I freaked out a little bit. Great movie. I think the families are gonna love this movie. People from all ages are gonna dig it. This is Satin Stratus. I'm looking for a new act to open up for my show. We should take some questions. Do you relate to the film's story, themes, or messages? Sparkle is this young girl. She loves her mother and she really wants to please her mom, so I definitely related to Sparkle on that front. That's a huge theme within that the is. movie, too, is just family, you know, you always go back to that. Fate. What y'all doing in there? My babies. I know y'all don't love each other that much. <laughs> what was it like working with Jordan? Did you get to hear her sing? I did. <laughs> My kids were big fans of Jordan, so. When I told him I was on the set with him, he was like, Daddy, we want a picture, we want an autograph. <laughs> You're gonna get a chance to see in the new Sparkle, uh, Celine McKeel, great director, bring back this incredible music mm -hmm. that was played from back in the 60s. Mm -hmm. Just just feel good music. Like oh, yeah. it just it just makes you feel good when when you listen to it. Y'all came out there, y'all was out there, had the move. <laughs> <Jump. Doom, doom. laughs> Mike, what attracted you to the role of Satin? I really think Satin was something that I really wanted to engulf myself into because it was a, a role that was very challenging to me. Hell, if I had any sense, I'd be living off you. He did that to you, didn't he? Looking at you play this character that was just so heavy, yet could yeah. have such tender moments. Oh my gosh, yeah. it, was, it was crazy. Did you see the original movie? And what was your first impression when you seen it? Irene Kerr walked into the screen, and I was like, "Wow, we can be twins. Mm -hmm. And right after I saw it, I bought the original soundtrack. There are some original songs, new original songs that were just written as well. R. Kelly did an amazing job. There's a song with CeeLo. There's a song with Guapale. The last song that Whitney did was a song with me called Celebrate. Working with her was an incredible thing. Why would the Lord give me this gift if I wasn't supposed to use it? It takes a lot of faith. Do this, Michael. What are the memories of seeing Whitney Houston before, oh, before she passed? Not only did I love her growing up and listen to her music and sing it all over the place and have sang it before, being able to be with her on set was a whole nother experience in and of itself. It when you say the phrase, she was real, like right. that was what Whitney Houston was. Why? Was my life not enough of a cautionary tale for you? It don't get no bigger. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for tuning in. Follow at Sparkle Movie and please check out facebook.com slash sparkle. Holla, holla, peace. <laughs> Can I